and today I'm going to be making pizza. Cooking is an ancient art form, and just like with any art, artists come and go, with each of the generations bearing witness to the greats of their respective art. Some saw Van Gogh, some saw Picasso. We have Kay's cooking. Now, if you don't know who Barbara K. Lee is at this point, well, honestly, I've just got to ask you, what are you doing? with your life? Because if the muttering of the words case cooking does not send a chill through every bone in your body, well then obviously you've been living under a rock since the day you were born. Welcome to the real world, buddy. Pizza on toast. I don't really know what that means, but this is Kay's most recent upload, and I saw the thumbnail, and I nearly went into cardiac arrest, and usually that means it's gonna make a good video, so, uh, here we are. Now, you guys know I'm not the biggest fan of hot dogs, but I don't know if I've also expressed my disdain for raw tomato. I can do, like, chili or salsa or tomato sauces, that's fine, but something about raw tomatoes, man, I just can't do them. So, this thumbnail is already triggering some sort of response in my body, so not really looking forward to the end product product here, but uh, when are we ever? Let's begin. Please subscribe. Hi people, and I'm back cooking again. And today, I'm going to be making bread pizza. Okay, what does that mean? Like pizza, but the topping is bread? Or like pizza, but the dough is just a giant thing of sourdough? I don't get it. Can you imagine going to a pizza party and somebody whips out an 18 inch large bread pizza and it's just a giant pizza with little slices of bread as the topping? As you can see, I've got two slices of white bread and the reason why it was white bread because on her video she showed white bread. So, she said, but to them, the best, 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 bread? the best, no, shut it. Am I going insane? Or are these two pieces of bread one slice of bread that's been cut in half? These slices do not look up to the standard thickness of a regulation piece of bread. Right, I couldn't get any sausages to cut up, so... I bought them. And these are, I don't know, I took the front of the packet off, but let's just show you, <laughs> let's just show you what they are. Oh, how nice of you, Kay. Thank you. I couldn't quite decipher what I was looking at when you only showed me two of them, but now that I've seen ten of the exact same thing piled on top of each other, I know exactly what we're dealing with. I mean, are these not just pepperonis? Or some other sort of sliced various meat combination? I mean, if you can't see after I put them on the bread, then there's something wrong. Wow, well, okay. All right. You know, I don't really appreciate that sort of tone. I don't think anybody was complaining about the current camera and pepperoni situation. I think we're all seeing just fine. Fine. I mean, you're kind of starting to hurt my feelings here, so I really wish you'd stop. Put on tomatoes so things move around, knife comes out, and voila, there's a board underneath. Um, excuse me, Kay, did you buy this knife off the CSGO store or something? Where did you acquire this utensil? What's next? She's going to whip out a karambit to cut up some garlic? Done. Now that's going to go on to... Right, as you can see, I've put some, some, some... Tomatoes on. Yeah, tomatoes, please, if we're going to have a name. And it says sprinkle a bit of... I want to say chutney, but it says parsley on. Here's the thing. I know some people like tomatoes, so I don't usually judge food based off things I don't like because that's not fair. Some people like ingredients I don't like and vice versa. However, my mother loves tomato sandwiches. That's something she really likes that I cannot understand how a person would ever want to eat that. And I sent her a picture of this. Not a fan. I mean, first off, these tomatoes look a little bit past their prime and the camera's kind of throwing things off. It's making the proportions look weird, but you gotta remember this is one piece of bread. There is an entire tomato on one piece of bread. I just don't think this would be appetizing to anybody. I don't know what made me want to say chutney. So now... Oh, oh, not even looking at me. 
Um, okay. Did a, uh, did a piece of your finger just fall off? Did you just happen to have a slice of ham chilling in your hand while cooking? What just happened? Then it says to pour. And the bread's gonna soak all that up. She didn't say pour it all on, did she? I am... I am really starting to get confused on what we're actually making here. Why did you just pour what I'm assuming is egg all over your tomatoes? I mean, granted, I've never made a bread pizza before, but what is what is that for? We're making a pizza, and so far we have bread, butter, pepperoni, tomatoes, and egg. Yet, no tomato sauce or cheese. Safe to say, I'm sort of confused. There we are. And that... Oh, no, no, sorry. My mistake, we forgot the top, ping, topping, sorry Lee, <laughs> sorry Lee, I'll put it this way, I don't think that's enough cheese on, I love, I love, I love pe cheese on my pizza. Oh yeah, okay, me too. I really love a good cheese on my pizza. I also like the tortilla on my burrito. And here is the end product. I told you there weren't enough cheese on there. Here is the taste test. Right guys, so now, why is it so loud? Right guys, here's the taste test. <laughs> right. Mm. Very nice, but strangely enough, it doesn't taste like pizza. Strangely enough, Lee, really? Out of all of the phrases you could have chose, you chose that one? Not to nobody's surprise, as we all expected. You are eating tomato toast. Why would it taste like pizza? Just because you name something a pizza in a YouTube title does not mean it's going to taste as such. Even though the bread is there, it's just like toast. It's like you just literally took all the toppings off of a pizza and just slapped it on toast. Hmm. I wonder what might make it taste that way. Why would a piece of toast that has various pizza toppings on it taste like toast with various pizza toppings on it? I think we might need to look further into this mystery. Well guys, what do you think? Would you eat this pizza on toast as we're calling it apparently? I think I'd take one look at this in real life and probably start crying. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and walk on over to that subscribe button and touch it. It's free. It won't cost you anything. But for now, that's all I have for you today. Bye. Subscribe.